So um, just remember that the speed is the absolute value of your velocity. And then whenever the signs for velocity and acceleration are the same, then we know that the speed is increasing. If they are opposite signs, then we know the speed is going to be decreasing. And then just make sure we define these as well. So we're looking at t equals 3 seconds. So the first thing we want to do is find v sub t, which is just going to be the derivative, which is 2t minus 4. And then a sub t is just going to be the derivative of that, which is equal to 2. So now we want to find what is the sign when it's going uh, to the left or to the right. And then, can I say explain on this one? This says justify, actually. So let's figure out what v sub 3 is. v sub 3 is going to be 2 times 3 minus 4, which is equal to 2. And then this is feet per second. Now, how do we figure out a sub 3? Can we plug a 3 in anywhere? What do we do? Anybody, anybody got a good idea? Yeah, it just equals 2, guys. All, if you were like to graph this as a line, you know, y equals 2, it's just a solid line. So it doesn't matter what the x value is. It's always y value is always 2. So this is going to be 2 feet per second squared. So our, it doesn't matter that they're the same. Are they the same sign? Yes. So we can say, since v sub 3 is greater than 0, and a sub 3 is greater than 0, the particle's speed is increasing. So please get a 